guys, I figured, um, it's been a while since I've done a video of me just doing stuff and I don't really have anything specific to do today, so I'm just gonna bring you along kind of vlog style. I've got a bit to do in the shed, but nothing really exciting. And show you the unglorious side of working on saws and engines. So, here I've got my stuff. Um, I've just gone out and cut some wood. I've got my saws and stuff I need to clean up. Up on the bench I've got a Honda generator that I've pulled down and then um, I'm leaving that. So that needs cleaning up. Got my saw storage under there. Got the dead 044, couple of 08s, pile of dead 010 parts. Then I've got a 365 in the box down there. At the back I've got the pooling and a couple of old Macs. Um, yeah, so I'll just bring you over here and I'll clean this stuff up. Oh yeah, and I also bought myself a pressure vacuum tester, which I should have done a long time ago, so I've been kind of fiddling around with different bits and pieces for that. Alright, so here's the saw. It's got the bar upside down just to annoy everyone, because I know everyone loves that. Um, so this just needs a clean and a sharpen, because I've been cutting some roots with it. Um, I had to cut some roots for my uncle. So, um, give it a wipe down. And now I've just got to sharpen this one, so I'll grab the next one here. Got the John and Jono saw I'm testing. Um, had its share of use.
And one thing I've found with this chainsaw, this 84cc saw, is that <coughs> you have to have this filter screwed right down, otherwise it doesn't seal. So you've got to have that nut on the top cranked down as hard as it'll go. Alright, so now I'm just going to sharpen the chains up, boring stuff, if you want to watch a good sharpening channel, don't watch me, um, Buck and Billy Ray Smith, he has some really good sharpening videos, um, he's a bit of an odd fellow, but his content's pretty good.